Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are in Oshkosh, Wisconsin and yes, we are going to Target. So I love this Target because it's never overcrowded and it's very easy to get in and out of and I love that there is a Starbucks inside this Target. So usually what I do when I come here is I get a little cup of coffee, I relax, I shop around, and it's just a very, very nice experience. So here we are walking into the store. I've got my Vera. I haven't switched over to fall yet because it's still August. So we're dealing with the lemons still and the mint green Vera Bradley bag. So here we go to the cart. We're going to put our Vera in and away we go. Now, the first thing I see when I get into this Target is this little tiny dollar spot. It is so small. It literally consists of two little cubicles and they barely have any fall decor. So they had this little plaque. They had the pumpkin weights as you saw when I walked in. They had this little thing. They had like a pumpkin little basket on the side there. And as far as I could tell, that was it, ladies and gentlemen. Um, they had these little, these little things, these little pillows, the cabana boy towel. It looked like there was a pube on there. Um, and then they had these plants for $14.99, the large plants. I didn't feel them because they looked a little sick. And I didn't want to get any bugs on me. But yeah, then they had these little candles. Um, oh, I think this was a little like Thanksgiving Day candle. Really, really nice for a bathroom. Then I noticed that the Starbucks was closed. It said until August. I calmed myself down and I just moved on. So no coffee from Starbucks today, you guys. But don't worry, I have a surprise later on in this video. So I started walking through the store and I noticed these hideous looking clothes. I guess that's the fashion for the teeny boppers when they go back to middle school and high school. And that's what they're going to have to deal with. So I just basically wanted to hit three departments in this Target. I, I couldn't stand to look at the clothes. So we're going to hit the beauty section. Then we've got some e.l.f. primer. We're going to hit the uh, cleaning section for the laundry detergent and stuff like that. And then we're going to hit the pets later on. But here is some Maybelline mascara. They had a ton of mascara to choose from, which was very nice and refreshing. I still haven't bought any mascara um, because my Estee Lauder is still in full effect. So we will use that until it is gone. Here we have some NYX primer. The primer is like hitting really hard at all stores that I've been to. So if you guys are into that primer, I mean, there is no shortage. Here are the nails for $10. And then we're moving on. Um, just kind of looking here. We have some makeup bags and some makeup brushes. I really wish that these would pop out because I wanted to, to feel it more, but I love the big ones for the powders and the blushes. Um, here I spotted a bitch on the box. There she is. That's a new bitch. It's a new one. I've never seen her before, I don't think. Um, and yeah, here we have um, what is this? Is this Revolution? Yeah, Revolution. Here we have the Fix and Glow to make your skin dewy. This is the primer that I use by e.l.f. I really like it a lot. It's usually about 10 bucks, and I just buy it at Walgreens. Here we had a Hello Kitty with, uh, with Pixie. Hello Kitty with Pixie. I think I've seen that before on Rich Lux's channel. And then we have the water-based cleaner, which I love for my eyes. Um, just to get all of that makeup off of the skin 
and to feel fresh and clean. Now, here we have the air de toilette. Um, now, I'm going to be honest about all of these little perfumes. These perfumes are not for adults. I feel like these are for like grade school kids wanting to be, you know, feel feeling like they're older because this stuff doesn't stick to me at all. It's basically like toilet water. You can smell it right away and then you go on without your, you know, throughout your day and you don't smell a thing. It's like useless. I was spraying this stuff and it I couldn't smell any of the rose. Um, so yeah, I wouldn't even wear this if I was like a high schooler. I would get this for my daughter who's in second grade, who is like just playing with makeup and want to do like a dress up type thing. And if she wants to feel older, you know, that's something that, that she could do. Um, but yeah, I just, I don't really like, I don't really like their perfumes. Here we have some sugar scrubs all of the different sugar scrubs. You'll see these on the little TikToks that the kids do. Oh, and here, now these were these new like shampoo and conditioners. I found them very interesting. They had the masks and then they have these little things down below that you would add to the shampoo and the conditioner. Interesting, right? I don't know if I'd want to like mess with that though. Like if I buy a shampoo and a conditioner, I don't want to buy something else that you would mix into it and then shake it up. It just seems like too much. Like that's too, too much for me to handle. Too, too much thinking going on there. When I'm in the shower, I don't want to like mix anything. And I know you pre-do it, you know, but still. Here we have the native um, shower gel. I felt like I was having issues with my camera. Oh yeah. And then there's the method. So ever since I did the upgrade, oh, I bought this by the way too. I'll show you in later on in the video, um, what I all bought, but yeah, I felt like I was having problems with my camera ever since I did the upgrade. Um, I've noticed that my camera has been like, it feels like it's blurry and I don't know if it's just me or not while recording could be the lights in target. I don't know. Here we have Mrs. Meyers cleaners. Um, hand soaps, dish soaps, candles. I was actually looking for the Mrs. Meyers lavender scented laundry boosters. They did not have it. That's my favorite. I get that at Grove. And look, they have Grove Company at Target. Here we have some fall scented Febreze. They had it in the apple crisp and the pumpkin and that's all they had i was looking for it um over here in the febreze and i didn't see anything fall not yet it's just too early here they have some method laundry booster i did have that um green one already that one right there and it's okay you know it's whatever as you guys can see i'm really into the boosters um, they had that cotton one by Downy, which I've never smelled before. And it smelled really good for like towels and stuff, you know. And here they had all of the food. So our Target, you know, has like a grocery section and then the other section. Everything was nice and clean. There were employees everywhere, you guys. It was really nice. So now we're going to get into the pet section. And I was really kind of bummed about this department I thought that they were going to have more things and they didn't. There's a little bow tie for Rocky Rococo. I've been told that I dress him like a girl. So I'm trying super hard to not put bows in his tooties to just leave it blank. So he looks more masculine. Who are we to know if he, if he thinks he's a boy or a girl? I'm not going to judge. And then I was looking for toys that had that little crinkle. Um, and I was looking at that one, that one little squeaks. This one had the crinkle. 
And Snooky Louise loves that crinkle, so I decided to get that. It was by BarkBox, a little dragon. It has a little squeaker in it as well. You will see that later on in this video when I give it to her. And she loves it. Here's a little avocado. Um, just some bits and bobs. They were restocking a lot of things. So here I found some Nutro treats. This is the name brand of dog food that I give my dogs, Nutro Ultra. Um, but they were hard, and I like soft treats for my dogs. Uh, here they had a little birthday section, just in case your dog has a summer birthday or a birthday at any time of the year. Target is set with some birthday treats and birthday toys. And that was pretty much it for the pet section. So I was on my merry way. Let's go to Duncan, you guys. I was a little bit upset, not gonna lie, that the Starbucks was closed at Target. And I know they didn't have their pumpkin stuff come out yet, but Dunkin' Donuts did. So I'm actually gonna try here and see if Dunkin' is open. I believe they are right here, yes. And um, I am definitely going to try, oh shit. Um, whoops, I guess I'm not supposed to go in this way, but whatever. Um, I'm gonna try and get some pumpkin coffee because mama needs it badly. Whoa, watch where you're going, bitch. Watch where you're going. Oh my God. Um, yeah, so I wasn't too impressed, you guys, actually, with the Target. Good morning, what can we do for you? Good morning, could I get the, um, let's see, the pumpkin cream cold brew, please, in a large? You got it, what else can we do for you? Uh, that should be it, thank you. All right, 461, see you in the window. Okay, thanks. Here we go, we're gonna get it. I love the shirt. Oh, nails. thank you. Thanks. Did you want a straw? That would be awesome. What about a receipt? Um, yes, okay. thank you. And there you go. Great, thank you, you so much, you too. Hi. Have a great day. You too. Okay, you guys, let's try out this pumpkin coffee. I'm excited. Now, I've never had a pumpkin cold brew before, so this is new to me. It's got a lot of cream on the top and then the pumpkin coffee on the bottom. Oh my gosh, let's see. Where do I want to go here? Oh, I can't even turn that way if I wanted to. Okay, here we go. Anyway, um, okay, let's take... A sippity sip and see. Oh my god. Oh, this is nice. You know why I like this? Because it's not overly sweet. Mmm. A plus for the Duncan. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Thank you so much, Duncan. Donuts for coming out with your pumpkin coffee way before you were supposed to or allotted. Um, I know a lot of people get really upset, including myself when they push the back to school and they push fall when it's still summer. But the pumpkin stuff, you guys, that is one thing that I will not complain about because mama definitely loves her pumpkin. Yum. Okay, you guys, real quick, I'm going to show you what I got at Target. Um, I did pick up a dog toy. The reason why I got this one is because Snooky Louise loves the crinkle. She's already over here. Um, she loves the crinkle, and this is by BarkBox. So it has the crinkle, and it has... Oh, I know he wants to see what's going on too. It has the crinkle and it has a squeaker, so that's really nice. And I only picked up one. 
Um, the tail also has kind of like a hard little nub in here. And um, because she doesn't have any teeth, it's, you know, really important that I pick up like really good toys for her. And she already wants this one, so I'm going to unpack it and give it to her real quick. And look at her just sitting there waiting patiently for it. So <laughs> there's your toy, baby. You tell oh, she's going to take it and just go. Okay, and then I also, oh, and now he's squeaking the other one. Sorry about that, you guys. I know this video is like a mess already. Um, but then I picked up some of the Method body wash. Now I've never seen this on the Grove website because that's where I've been ordering all of my Method body wash. But this one is in the fragrance Magnolia and it's the hydrating one. Uh, winter is right around the corner, which includes dry skin for me. So I'm just going to give this one a little sniff again. Yeah, it smells really good. It has a light floral fragrance to it, but still really nice and clean. So that is what I bought um, at Target. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you want to see more and thumbs it up. And yeah, be safe. God bless. And I will see you all soon. Bye guys. Rocky.